JR was out with a hamstring. Christian rested with his knee. It's not a major issue. Torin Harris has a concussion. We'll continue to test him. Brian Bauckham, hamstring. Gio, Gio's shoulder still, and Cody Temple is still out. And Christian Thomas's uh, hip, we held him out. Um, in anticipation for tomorrow morning, we don't have any walkthroughs, just meetings. Um, guys will finish up summer two, and then tomorrow night will be their first big test um, at 7 o'clock in the Coliseum. We'll treat that like a real game, um, which is a little bit different from what we've done here in the past. You know, We'll tackle the entire time, probably be over there three hours, and um, you'll know, see where we're at. Where do you think you're at? Uh, I don't know, because we haven't really tackled. You know, and That's obviously a big part of the game, so it'll be... Um, Interesting to put our guys in full speed decision making, and um, and we'll see. I, don't know that. I think we're better on defense, but we'll find out. Will you be cutting? Because that's obviously an important part of figuring out your offensive line. Yeah, for the most part, we won't. Um, at times, in these type of things, we, we may put in, um, you know, our th third defense defensive front, um, just because you know the cut blocks can be so dangerous. No, you're. You know, anticipating seeing everyone, but based on what you've seen these first few practices, are there any players in particular that you want to see in, full, in the full pad situation? Well, I think in general, um, that would be any guys that haven't played, whether that's the true, all the true freshmen or guys that redshirted or guys coming back from injury, um, guys that we haven't really, you know, been to battle with there on the field and seen. So um, it's really big for all of them, especially those guys. After the defense dominated yesterday, how uh, how do you feel about how the offense responded today? It was good. It was better. Um, huge emphasis, you know, over the last 24 hours about turnovers after five interceptions. Um, you know, and then to go the whole game until the last play there, which was kind of we were just kind of you know going on a deep ball emphasis. So it really wasn't. We wouldn't have done that normally. So the quarterbacks were a lot better in that, um, led by Matt. Are any of the young guys um, starting to? Not hit the wall, but I mean, are you seeing any of the uh, I don't know, symptoms that, that usually crop up when guys start having to learn more of an installation? Yeah, I mean, that's going to happen every year, no matter what. Even even the kids, uh, you know, your Robert Woods or the Kelly Robies, you know, they, you know, they all hit it no matter what. It's just not high school. I mean, there's so much stuff that goes into it, so many little tips from riders. Um, so they're all hitting it. Some hit it harder than others. Guys that break through and keep plugging away, or guys that are not playing for us. Oh, holding up physically, long practice, a lot of you know challenge at every play and all that. How are they doing physically? Do you think? I think I think they're doing well. Um, you know, the, the injury list is, is still um, okay, and so you know we'll, we'll keep up with this. And they go to a point, obviously, we'll slow down. You know, in that fourth week, but um, it's too important for us to uh, maintain this tempo. This type of energy um, for our team. Their charging time today? No, because of the game. You know, because of the game, it, it, it'll be a real game, and so you know, that's why we're, we're in an afternoon session here, and then tomorrow night, so we have over 24 hours off right now, off our feet. We still have a bunch of meetings. So. How much of the playbook are you guys using right now? Uh, not very much. You know, we're through four days of install. We don't install on day five, so. Um, I don't know, 25 percent. Any separation with the uh, running backs? Anybody standing out? No, no. I mean, we're standing out. Continues to every day. I don't think there's a lot of separation because that position is so much based off of real, real game stuff. You know, receivers. There's not a whole lot of difference. Sometimes quarterbacks and certain things. But um, running backs. You know, how are they going to pass protect when it's live? How are they going to hold on to the ball? How are they going to take? You know, if they have to carry it 15, 20 times tomorrow night.